Hello everyone. This is my third time trying to record. <gasps> I'm getting so frustrated. I am Malin Solis and you guys might have seen my video of my two birds. They are cockatiels and they are not here because they have a really big cage and we don't have enough space. And we're just in a motel and we're it's I'm nine years old. My birthday passed April 12th, so if you want to celebrate, thank you, whoever's watching, Markiplier, if you're watching. I'm your big fan. Totally big fan. Send me a message or comment. I'll be checking. Yeah, so um, let's get back. Sorry if Markiplier, you're watching. It's just... <laughs> And so, um, here I have my beetle, sorry if I showed you. Her name is Dark. Um, my mom and dad know about her since my friend gave it to me. My teacher friend, and I'm only nine. And it's 2015 right now. And I'm on spring, summer, I mean spring break, or whatever it's called. And I'm in third. I'm a third grader. I'm gonna be entering fourth grade next year. And so, if you're wondering how many pets I have, I have five. I might be getting a guinea pig, which will be six. So right now, I have Hammy the hamster. Hammy, come on, get out, get out, get out, you can get your chance. Come here. Come here. Uh. Yep. And so, there she is. Let's put her back in the cage. So, don't start peeing on me. Yeah, and so the first tip you need is get a ball. It has to be clean. I have been in the hamster race. I won second place. And so what, it has to be clean, and if it's wet, you're going to have to leave it for about three or five minutes. And how you would want to put a hamster is, um, it's, it, you're going to have to leave a hamster to about ten minutes in there, because if it's longer than that, your hamster might have problems breathing, because they are not too many holes and you have to take them out a bunch of times to have them drink water or to eat so um here i made a snack bowl here's your snack bowl i put cucumbers then i she usually brings her food down here down there by her water bottle and so yeah I don't really like it so here is my other pet my dog Dixie here is uh, sorry here is Dixie my pit bull she's a blue nose and she's so adorable she's a blue nose pit bull she's a girl her name is Dixie my hamster's name is Hammy. My beetle's name is Dark. And my two birds. One is a boy, which is. If you want to see the channel, go to My Bird's Beauty and Still. And so, sorry if I'm messing it up. I'm recording on my tablet. And so, the first tip you need to know about hamsters is how to keep them safe. You know, how to keep them safe is, um, well, letting them sleep, not waking them up. And the second thing is, if they bite on the bars that I just showed you about the cage, if they bite on it, that means that they are bored and the cage is too small. So, my cage is small, which I'm going to be building a bigger one by myself with with my mom and dad 
so it's not cradled by myself. And here in my room is a big mess. I am going to be entering fourth grade. Sorry if I'm getting a little bit off track. And so um, the next thing is that you would want to... You want to hold them like that, not grabbing them. They might think you're grabbing them like, you know, those toy thingies that you have to try to scoop them up. That's how they feel, how you're grabbing them. And so, <coughs> yeah. I also wanted to show you um, about, ah, I forgot, that's, Hello, now I remembered. So I wanted to show you about how to treat them and, well, feed them. You know how you want? I only have these cubes, which I'll show you in a minute. Sorry about this. I only have these kind of cubes, which mom, I need to get other ones. And she loves these and she won't eat another kind of food. I want to see if she would try the special kind of food that I've seen. And I have bedding, which are for birds. And she really, 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 really loves it. And so I leave it like that. But um, you're going to have to clean the cage if you have a hamster. Mostly once a week if you well, to me, if you don't, uh, to me, I think of her having a heart attack or a wet tail. And I don't want none of that to happen since I've only had her for a month. And she, I think she's still a baby. I have to go check since they never told me if she was a grown-up or a baby. And so, what you need to do is, for hamsters, what you need to do is have to keep them safe, have to keep them high from any other animal like my dog Dixie and my, what is it called? Well, just my dog, unless I get another one or cat. I'll never get a cat. Sorry. Sorry, hopping hammy and all those things that put about hamsters. I am sorry, I just hate them. My whole family does, I hate clowns. I mean, I think I'm scary. And so, yeah, um, what I was talking about is you're gonna have to have a house, which I only have a house and this. Sorry if you guys can't see, I'm trying my best. Gah, stupid your back. And so, yep. That's her yellow house. She's starting to knock them down. Knock it down now that she's growing a little bit bigger. I, and I don't really like it. So we're going to have to get it. I'm going to have to make it when we get back home. And so, yeah. And the next thing is about the food. Which, I mean, water. The water cannot be cold because that might give her brain freeze and that ca can cause wet tail which I don't really like that causing wet tail and so what I plan mostly to do is sorry if it's bright yeah. what I plan mo ow, ow. what I plan mostly to do is um to just keep your hamster safe hey, the air cannot be too cold or too hot so what I like to do is keep her in this corner here so there can, there can still be wind coming to her, just not so much. So what I like to do sometimes, I like to keep her in her ball running so she can have a little bit of fresh air. And I keep her in her ball like for nine minutes. So I have, I mean, five minutes, so I have the other five minutes to play with her. And I have to go to bed early. And so, yeah, um, how to make a cage? They are usually called bin cages. Um, I'll draw you one, sorry, if there's lots of things on here. So, how to, how do you, how to make a bin cage is there's a cage that is a bin 
that you can buy somewhere. And so that's the one I'm gonna get. Sorry if I'm not a good artist. So I'm gonna get one and it's gonna look like that, but I'm gonna have it a different color. Sorry about the writing if you can't see it. That's what it's gonna look. And how I'm gonna cut it is I'm gonna cut two sides here and put foil. And I'm gonna cut them on both sides and on top too. So it's gonna be looking like that. Then what you're gonna want to do is add bedding, which I'm just drawing swirly. You're gonna have to add bedding. I'm gonna make her like some kind of top thingy be made out of wood thingies and so I'm gonna make her a little hideout for her to hide in and it's gonna have flowers everywhere and but on uh, here where it's gonna be it's gonna have flowers so right here I'm gonna make it have hats And, well squares and so that's how it's gonna look so far then we're gonna have to have a bed which I'm gonna buy her the purple one next time and yeah so so it's gonna be looking like that And so, Dude, it's in the bucket. Oh. and so the next thing is you'll want to, whenever you leave or want to go outside, you might want to add a blanket. So just in case eagles or any kind of animal comes, um, they won't see them. And it's very dangerous if you come to flies because they might drop it and get eaten and yeah if my mom and dad said if that ever happens i'll get her really and so yeah you will want to leave one side open so they have air coming in and if you want to make a playpen you would have to meet Wood, and that's how I'm deciding mine to look like since I don't know how to make a bigger one this is how it's gonna look like let me show you in a minute guys sorry if it's taking so long so this is how it's gonna look like and I'm gonna have toys everywhere all these dots are the toys and a little hideout that's square See, it's gonna be the hideout, and I'm gonna have a little tube that has an opening, and it should be looking like that. And so, yeah, and I'm gonna put flowers everywhere. I'm gonna draw them and color them so she would have something. So, okay, so you want to put it around, which you could buy tape, which I don't like tape since that's really bad for hamsters. And so, yeah, that's the end of my video. Well, it was nice meeting you, and see you in the next video. Bye-bye! And I'll talk about something else instead of hamsters. Or if you want, I'll still talk about hamsters. Bye-bye, though.